Hey guys, welcome back to part 2 of moving across country. We stopped at my parents place last night. My dad was actually pretty interested in the 240 so I sent him on a drive with it. I don't think he took any videos but I can tell he enjoyed it by the way I heard him shift. Sounded like he shifted at red line. Anyways let's hit the road. I'm gonna be driving the 240 and putting the F90 on the tow truck today. I just feel like driving the 240. Again, huge thanks to RP Designs and WOTC for helping. Alright, let's get on the road and get out of here. I'm gonna attempt to keep talking but I'll cut out where I don't. I'm really happy with how both my cars look so when I get settled down. I'm gonna look for a new project car. Maybe I'll find a clapped out Civic or something. Or something rear wheel drive to drift. Who knows? I'm open to any cars as long as it's manual because as of right now, I can't do a transmission swap. That engine swap was difficult enough. RP just took the fuck off in that van. It's fine though. I like driving next to my F90. I really need new wheels though. First thing I'm gonna do is order up some new wheels once I'm settled down. Loki almost got rear-ended. It's fine though. Alright. We've been driving for a while now so we just stopped for a stretch break. The closer we get to my new house, the more excited I become. Let me actually talk about how I met RP and WOTC. So RP used to work for bullshit shipping and he stopped working just after he bought my Sirocco. He now lives in the same apartments as the guy I, well my ex-boss bought the 240 from. I'm looking forward to see what he does with the Sirocco. And then WOTC is a childhood friend who lives up the road from my parents place. Both are really cool people. Obviously these are just a random dudes I found on reddit but this is a role play and I can say whatever the fuck I want. It's all for shits and giggles so why not make up some backstory. Anyways we're gonna hit the road again. Um now what topic do I talk about? This is an interesting and real life one. As about a month ago, time of editing, I got into a minor accident in my parents car. Basically my foot got stuck on the carpet and in an attempt to get it unstuck I dumped the clutch and because the car has a mind of its own it didn't stall but kept driving and I took too long to react and I hit the wall. Minor scratches but it's still really noticeable. Because the car is silver and you see everything on silver cars. Anyway so the car went in to get that scratches ray sprayed and I think it looks decent. Just the parking sensor is a bit uneven but it's barely noticeable. You know you have good friends when they stop when you do a pull. This car's brakes are insane. Where are these guys going? Oh shit yeah, we need gas.
I just got some water. Let's get going again. Shit, I need to keep talking. So I need to find a place that rents out tow trucks because now that the tow truck I usually use is on the other side of the map, I can't use it. Or I could buy one but then I need a place to keep it. I'm also gonna look at renting a warehouse because I'm gonna slowly start employing people to work for me. And as a bonus I'll have space to keep more cars that my garage can't contain. And I'm not too keen on parking a shit ton of cars outside because that could make it seem like a good spot to break in. Which I'm not loose for. I'm not sure if I'm definitely gonna do this but I might be taking a short Christmas break. So I'll post the Monday before and the Friday after which gives me plenty of time to relax and refresh to go full grind mode in 2022. I'm also starting to work on a year recap type video which I'll post on the 31st so expect that too. I think I'm also gonna start posting for Legends from 2022. I know I said something about it last video, but disregard that. Go with what I said here. I've also gotten an offer to trade my F90, a 2018 for a brand new 2021 BMW M2, and it'll get an extra couple thousand. Do you guys think I should do that? It's not that I want to get rid of the F90 but I also really love BMW M2, but I also want a 4-door daily so I'm not sure what to do. And obviously I'm not getting rid of the 240 so I'm kinda stuck, but the new warehouse I might be able to get will open up a lot more opportunities for new cars but who knows. Maybe I trade the F90 and buy it cheaper for door daily. But then again why would I daily a cheap car when I have a brand new M2 in my garage? But that's another times problem. I really love driving this shitbox. We're almost there and I'm so excited. I finally have my own house that I own. We're here. I've honestly never felt happier. Now all I need is to unpack and relax, but that's tomorrow's problem because we are all so tired from driving. And here comes the F90.
Alright, we're gonna go inside and relax. Then we'll unpack tomorrow and send RP and WTC on their way back home. Again, huge thanks for both of them for helping out. Hopefully we can get them in on more videos in the future. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed it then why not like and subscribe. Anyways, until next video. Peace.